alarming uptick in coronavirus cases with Florida catching the attention of top U.S. health officials. This is becoming a pandemic of the unvaccinated. The new development as the first coronavirus vaccine gets a step closer to full FDA approval. Plus, Disney bringing rapid growth to a once quiet part of Orlando. Growth is good, but it's not what we moved out here for. A closer look at the ripple effects Disney's newest campus will have on the area. And we have seen days of rallies in support of Cuban protesters across Central Florida, how police are handling the activists, and a new anti-riot law in Florida. everyone for joining us here on Spectrum News 13 this Friday evening. I'm Tammy Fields. Before we get to all of those headlines, let's get a quick look at your Weather on the Ones forecast this Friday night. Spectrum News 13, meteorologist David Eckert, another pretty quiet day out there Hi, across central Florida. Just a few light rain showers right. earlier across sections of Lake Marion and Sumter County. He's going to keep things pretty tranquil for the late evening and overnight time period. It can kind of muggy across the area, but that's to be expected this time of year. Temperatures low to mid 70s as we head into your Saturday. A little bit more moisture begins to return to the area. So it's a better bet for scattered showers and storms across the area with high temperatures climbing back in the low 90s. So your weather headlines get another fairly dry evening across the area. We are tracking better rain chances though for the weekend and a more typical rainy season weather pattern will likely return heading into next week. I'll be back with Clatron 13 and the very latest on how high rain chances get for the upcoming weekend. New information for you. Coming up on your weather on the ones.